first, uh, thank you very much for the people that believe in me and are saying that I have excellent game and all that. Uh, main thing is to uh, just keep grinding and putting in the work. Uh, a game like tonight, personally, I felt like tonight was an off game for me. Um, I felt like it's a learning experience game, uh, going up against active rebounders like uh, JM Kalma and uh, um, even Balagasai and the whole Northport squad. They're just really active on the rebounds tonight, so it, uh, it challenged me as uh, probably one of the better rebounders on my team. So uh, I felt tonight was a good, good learning experience for me. Oh, you want me to hold no, it? No, no. Okay. <laughs> My bad, bro. <laughs> uh, change some new um, guys like you, Jed Mendoza, and um, Missy are taking advantage of the, you know, what Tomei's given to the coach, Chito, um, or just your thoughts on that, getting that, uh, those minutes in this on tour? Um, I feel like it's just a step in the right direction for not just us, but the entire team. Because uh, Coach Cheeto has been talking about that a lot during this uh, off preseason, that he wants all of us to improve as a team, but especially individually. And uh, you know, I think he's giving us the time to really. Uh, I think he's giving us the time to really keep getting more confident and honestly get more confident with the entire team. Because I see it with my teammates too; they're they're more confident in passing me the ball, uh, passing. Jed the ball, pass, keep, keep giving Jarek the hand, uh, the, the shot when he's got the hot hand. So, uh, yeah, it's a big step in the right direction for Magnolia. You guys are six here, but obviously it's a you know, preseason tournament. How are you guys you know, treating something that's unbeaten river, but knowing that you still have uh, October, the season over? Um, I think the main thing is which is probably setting us apart from other teams, is that even though this is a preseason tournament and a lot of maybe players and analysts and article writers, they're, they're treating this as tune-up games. But for us, basketball is basketball, and it's a blessing to be able to play. You never know when it's your last game, and I think that's the mentality which we're really uh, embracing as a team which is you're only as good as your last game. So it doesn't matter what kind of game it is, whether it's practice, whether it's a tune-up game, um, we're putting in all our effort, and I think it's paying off. James, uh, do you see yourself as a better player now with these uh, games uh, here in the preseason? Oh, 100%. That's, <laughs> that's a, not, a, not a question. I. I I know that I've put in the work, a lot of hard work with my strength and conditioning coach, my personal coach in better basketball, and my coaches and playing teammates here at Magnolia. Um, yes, it is a very big boost to my confidence, but I'm just really trying to not let that get to my head and be too high because uh, that'll lead to complacency and I don't want that. Um, and I think I'm surrounded by great veterans like Rafi Rivas and Mark Baraka, Paul Lee, guys that have, uh, Calvin Abueva, guys that have, you know, reached that point. And they're always telling me, you know, more and more and more things to improve on. So uh, kudos to them. You, you haven't faced the likes of Dunmar and Jaffet, so is that also a reason not to be complacent? Of course. They're the, uh, for me, got, you know, Junmar, Japeth, Motau Tua, um, Christian Stan Hardinger, they're the, the best of the best in the PBA when it comes to the big men. So for me to be able to just play on the court against them, it's such an honor. And, uh, you know, I think I'm just polishing myself even more so that when I do get to face them again, hopefully I can bring something new to the table. And, uh, you know, I talked about this with my teammate, Jarek Misi, who just got player of the game. Great job, brother. Um, you know, the guys we're playing against in this PBA on tour, they're guys my age. You know, they're guys me and Jarek's age. So eventually, these are the guys that are going to be the main guys on their team in maybe five or six years. 
So, you know, we just got to respect everyone that plays on this court. Even if they're not on the team, like officially, we still got to respect them because everyone can play in the PBA. So, of course, I got to be ready to battle the monsters in Japan, Christian, Junmar. But I also got to give the respect to these same guys that are very awesome age. So, yeah.